All right, friends, I am so excited. Finally made it to cricket at the Sir Vivian Richards Stadium. And we got our tickets. It's my sister right there. We're about to go into the stadium and see what everything is all about. I think we have it. Welcome back to Vlogmas. I am coming at you with another video today. I'm really excited. I just put together my outfit for the day. I am going to get ready. We're going to grab a bite to eat and then hit up a cricket match. And then later today, go see a tree lighting. So rock with your girl and we'll see how everything unfolds. All right, kids. Your girl is dressed for All the right. day. This is today's fit. No, you don't. But yes, so this is my outfit. It's a Lily Pulitzer dress, and then I have on um, thong black sandals from Steve Madden. And so this is how I would be entertaining the day. And my little stunning shades are Michael Kors. So first things first, we're going to head out to get some food. One of my favorite little snack foods here in Antigua that I've loved ever since I was a kid was bun and cheese. So we're gonna get some bun and cheese and then we are headed to the cricket grounds to watch a cricket match. excited finally made it to cricket at the Sir Vivian Richards Stadium and we got our tickets it's my sister right there we're about to go into the stadium and see what everything is all about I think we got really good seats so let's see <music>
the crowd. So we decided to dip out of the game a bit early to avoid the rush that happens like at the end of every game. Um, but you know, this is a match. I will say all in all for my first cricket match, it was quite interesting. And I started to like understand the scoring a little bit toward the end. Um, I'm very proud of myself making strides. And I realized it's a very civilized sporting event. And unlike in my childhood, when in those wear shirt and sweat on all kind of contraption, their uniforms seem a bit more manageable and reasonable and suited for purpose. Performance play, not necessarily, I don't know what they thought they were playing before. Be that as it may, it was really good. Would I come back to another cricket match? Yes, I think I would want to learn some more about the game first. So that way I could um, really get into it. Cause like when they were cheering, I was like clueless as to why people were cheering on either side. And then um, just not really fully getting it, but it was fun. And the atmosphere was really, really nice. And aside from this loud, who did you call the horn? The man was blaring. A what? A vuvuzela. Aside from the vuvuzela. Conch shell. That was no conch shell. If you see the long arm um, plastic horn. It's from, it's from The vuvuzela that the man was blowing into. At first I had no idea what it was, but then when I saw him, aside from that, even the little kids who were there were annoyed by that sound. It was like really cool with the people cheering and stuff. Like it's a very civilized sporting event. Um, so yeah, I would definitely, I would definitely, definitely come again. So, we are now on our way to English Harbor to see the tree lighting. We've officially entered the Nelson's Dockyard National Park. Um, it is a historic landmark and really excited to see how things have changed here in English Harbor since I was here last. This is one of my favorite places to be. Also on this side is Shirley's Heights. It's usually, I don't know if it still is, but I think like Sunday night and Wednesday night, it was like the link, but I don't know if that's still the thing. So <coughs> I'll see you in a bit once we get there, but enjoy the view. Everyone who knows me knows that I love boats and especially boats in a harbor so like I'm super geeked out like I love English Harbor for that reason and I love being over here although it's like far out but I enjoy it so much check the views y'all specifically Pilar's Bar and Restaurant. Really cute, really like nice aesthetic and everything. Y'all see 
see this big ass black boat? It is gorgeous. Listen, I think the way to my heart might be to buy me a boat. And before anyone starts with, oh, that's a depreciating asset, don't care. favorite parts about Antigua for the holidays is sorrow. The big thing, we love it, we make it, we drink it, it tastes delicious. Not everyone can make sorrow well, so before you decide to quench the thirst of many, try it out at another time of year, but cheers. Folks, I just realized that I did not capture the actual countdown to the tree lighting. I was just so focused and in the moment, but here's what the tree looks like all nice and lit up. Hope you enjoyed this pretty scene as much as I did. All right, folks, that's the end of today's vlog. It was really happy day, and I really enjoyed spending time with all of you and all of the activities that I did. So let me know what you want me to do next, what you want me to see, what you want me to try, and I'll see if I can make it happen. As always, thank you so much for inviting me into your world and thank you for sharing a peace of mind. Until the next video, Avidasen!